Litecoin price prediction 2020. Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. And in today's video guys, I'm providing an update from my previous video on Litecoin. Litecoin is up above 85% and is getting ready for another big breakout. So if you are, you know, like Litecoin or invested in Litecoin, you really want to watch this video. I'll be sharing with you my exact entries, where I've been buying, where I've been selling. So hopefully you guys uh, can make some money of Litecoin as well, especially if it breaks out above $80. I'll be sharing in high time frame analysis on what I'm looking at Litecoin to do next. So guys, without further ado, let's get into the video. So if you want uh, an update of what my previous video was, watch this video three weeks ago. I've not made a Litecoin video in months. These two videos I made, I was looking at that Litecoin trade. So hopefully, uh, watch that video. I touched more on news and why I was bullish on Litecoin and explained exactly where I was buying. In this video, I'm providing an update and a high time frame view. So Litecoin had that huge rally, that crazy 2017 rally. And you know, a lot of people made even more money on Litecoin than Bitcoin. Then it broke down. This was the rally for Litecoin halving. Then it's been consolidating in this zone for a while. There's potential, you know, trend line breakout. I don't really trade trend line breakouts, but I know a lot of uh, big investors are looking at that. And the main zone I'm looking at is this $80 zone. If it breaks out above it and stays above it, so it doesn't just, you know, spike up and down, it does this and carries on. You know, my trade setup. If you're interested, I'll leave the links below. You, you should know my trade setup by now if you want to check us out, especially if Bitcoin and altcoin season happens you know it's a life-changing worth of uh, time it doesn't happen again it happens every few years and you know we're not sure if it will happen in crypto again if we do get a big breakout in bitcoin and cryptocurrency those two months you make more money than you know trading for three years so we'll see if we get that scenario but that is the high time frame bias on litecoin if we don't break out above it i'm not going to buy more i'll share with you exactly where i've been buying and selling when i go into the shorter time frame but high time frame that is my thoughts on litecoin two key news to repeat again is that Litecoin has that Mimble Wimble news and obviously that PayPal access gives a uh, Litecoin you know the exposure to a lot of new investors and that can help Litecoin push up fundamentally I might not be the biggest fan of Litecoin anymore but those two news I can see it being very bullish and that's why I made those videos so uh, let's get into the nitty-gritty and the shorter time frame trades so Litecoin guys was around here it was an inverse head and shoulders a trade I was looking to buy and a four-hour pullback so if you watch my previous video it was the inverse head and shoulders trade i was looking at uh, for a pullback to go long this was uh, i was this is the zone that i shared that i was looking to go long i missed that trade there i didn't buy litecoin there uh, and and if you watch the video my first target was 64 dollars and i said if it breaks 64 dollars this is similar to 80 dollars then litecoin can have a huge rally uh, and you know it pumped about 25 percent and if you i'm not saying use leverage if you're new but if you trade that with decent size that is a huge profit to gain so i'll share with you exactly how i traded it so i bought litecoin around 65 uh, you can see where I bought it. I posted exactly where I was going to buy the night before. And then a lot of people got better entry than me. There are some people got, you know, 25%. Uh, my stop was, was below 64. And I said, as long as it's above there, I'll be bullish. I didn't get the best entry. But as you can see, some people got even better entry than I did. What has Litecoin done? Litecoin even gave another setup. So if you guys trade know my strategy, I keep going on about it. Uh, if you guys bought that for a pullback, you know, if you join my course, even for a monthly trial, you get access to my course, my introduction to my course. I explain support resistance where to buy and sell because even if bitcoin goes up you know to 20,000 30,000 most of you won't make money because you don't know when to get in when to take profit so it's really important to have a strategy gave another pullback now it's hit my target and this morning i just posted a, a, that i'm looking to sell litecoin you know it's taking 75 percent off at 80 uh, 80 dollars it's actually gone up uh, uh, gone up more than where i sold and it's trying to push higher but that was my trade and i sold that so that's the trade review and again this is not after the fact in youtube i shared exactly how i was going to trade it uh, and then in the group i posted exactly when i was buying stop loss and targets so again if you're interested i'll leave the links below for you to check out and if you are uh, hopefully you guys are finding value on youtube as well if you're an experienced trader then you know the youtube videos should help you make money and we don't make money like this all the time when markets are going sideways i get trades wrong and you don't get this many trades but when markets are trending like this we really need to take advantage of this so 
what not for like that's great Rocco you made money I'm not showing off I'm just you know hopefully this helps you to see how I manage my trades where I take profit but now what now for Litecoin this is a huge resistance if Litecoin breaks out above $80 uh, I mean if you follow my strategy this for our pullback to 76 or 75 would be a trade again I draw Fibonacci indicators and moving average to predict the exact zone but that will be a zone I'll, I'll, I'm doing a live stream again in the group in the next hour I'll provide uh, where I'm going to look to buy but that will be the zone I'd look to buy but if it gets back above this red zone or we get a pullback here and then it trends higher that's where I look to get back into Litecoin I know I'll be paying a bit higher than where I sold at 80 but you know Litecoin could top out here and pull back so I'm, I'm following my strategy I've still got 25% on from that trade and I'll be looking for it to get back above there to buy more so that's the trade I'll be looking for in the uh, in in towards the end of the year and one thing I want to say I want to go back to the higher time frame that Litecoin nears nears uh, Litecoin usually performs really well towards the end of the year so you know this one was back end of you know December you know I'm not gonna have to talk about that we can see Litecoin did amazing if we look at 2018 even in 2018 uh, Litecoin had that dump but then December time Litecoin had a rally Litecoin had that huge rally uh, from December then if we come back to here this was December 2019 it had another rally and now it's rallying again and um, again I'm not just going to buy because it's December but if it breaks out gives me a setup we can enjoy a nice big breakout in Litecoin again I'll be sharing some targets now for Litecoin but let's see if it can give me another setup for me to go long in Litecoin so if I do get the setup some of the targets I'll be $100 would be my next target because we know you know $100 is a psychological level like 10k that would be a level people would take profit on and if it breaks out above Litecoin uh, before above hundred dollars then hundred and fifty and then if it breaks out above that then we can talk about moon targets that two three hundred percent breakout targets uh, and especially if there's news charlie lee trying to pump Litecoin and you know there's going to be Mimbo Wimbo PayPal news and other news coming out when there's good news you know traders get into uh, Litecoin before things start pumping then they pump the coin up and you know, bring good news get new uh, new traders buying at highs and then they dump the price that's how the market works we've seen it pump and dumps happen all the time so as traders i try to get in beforehand before all the new people get in and even in our group we're seeing new people joining now every day because you know coins are going up uh, bitcoin you know is breaking out again it could litecoin if litecoin breaks out bitcoin could be breaking out because uh, Previously, Litecoin broke out first. I've just made a post. I'll be looking for a Bitcoin trade now. Uh, previously, Litecoin broke out first and then uh, Bitcoin broke out six to seven, eight hours after. So that will be a trade I'm looking to take in Bitcoin when I go live in the group. So that's my uh, update on Litecoin, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoy it. Uh, let me have a quick look at Litecoin BTC. So another tr uh, chart I posted was Litecoin BTC. Again, high time frame. This could take months or weeks to play out. Uh, you can see Litecoin has pumped from these levels a few times. I'm watching for a possible you know wedge and then breakout so that's a big level trade I'm looking for that will be a high time frame Litecoin trade you know uh, I'll take this trade against BTC to increase my BTC holdings and I'm looking for the 50% level if Litecoin breaks out above this breaks out above 80 you can bet that I'm going to be buying a lot of Litecoin so that's the two key levels if you're completely new watch for a break above the 50% Fibonacci level and above $80 so around 4600 against BTC let's say and about 82 83 dollars against uh, dollar so if that happens in litecoin i'll be buying and i'll be very bullish if it doesn't if it breaks down i'll sell my 25 percent protect my wealth i've made 25 percent i've done it live on youtube you know people say lots of most videos talk uh, hindsight or say it's going to go to thousand dollars ten thousand dollars but don't provide actionable steps hopefully you guys found that helpful so thank you very much for watching I was going to do a bit of a news update. I've not really seen any more news on Litecoin. If, you, if I'm mistaken, please let me know. I followed the Litecoin Foundation and Charlie Lee. I've not really seen any more news. The key news I have seen is that Litecoin paper. That's the key news. Apart from that, I've not seen any. If there's any more news, let me know. I'm happy to have a look. So thank you very much. To end the video, what is your prediction for Litecoin? Do you think Litecoin will break that $100 mark in 2020? Uh, let me know. Comment below your Litecoin predictions and news about the project and about other coins as well again it's been amazing few days uh, bitcoin you know hopefully you guys have made money we've seen and you know 
people talk about that 2017 rally this rally has has been you know not short of amazing you know it's gone up above 300 percent so you know if you've been on waiting on the sidelines you know educate yourself on investing and trading and if we do carry on breaking out above 20k this could be a life-changing moment so thank you very much uh, check out our educational group if you're interested if not smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button i'll do another free live stream on youtube again uh, next month so make sure you turn on the notification button to get notified when i'm going live so thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel comment below your thoughts on litecoin and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much and go litecoin